Apparently camels can make a 12 block jump. Yeah, it's true, they need this guy in the NBA. But now let's see if a camel can protect you from the ender dragon. This is kind of a weird situation, how would a camel even get to the end? But yeah, it actually works, but it's not looking good for my camel. Are beehives more common in cherry grove biomes? Okay, there's literally three of them right here, it's definitely true. Does weakness stop you from being able to attack mobs? Okay, so I can still attack mobs when I have weakness, but when I punch the mobs it doesn't work, so this one is kinda true? Apparently you can't attack a camel's head. This one seems kinda weird, I'm sorry. Sorry, camel, if this doesn't work. Oh, it's actually true. How is this possible? Can you put armor trims on an elytra? No, you cannot. What about armor trims on a turtle shell? You actually can, and this thing looks really cool. I'm definitely gonna start wearing turtle helmets. Can you breed camels with cactuses? Alright, let's just feed them both some sharp objects. And yeah, somehow this one actually works. Do all camels run the same speed? So everyone knows that each horse moves at a different speed, but does this also work for camels? Okay, it's been 10 seconds and he made it here. Now it's time to try a different camel. Okay, it's the exact same speed. This one isn't true. Using the seed sniffer spawns you near a ruin with a sniffer egg in it. Okay, we got an ocean, but it's not a warm ocean. This one is false. Do hanging signs fit less text than a regular sign? So there's 60 characters on a regular sign, and there's only 40 characters on a hanging sign. This one is true. Is there a secret room in a desert well? No, it doesn't look like it. What about in a jungle temple? I mean, yeah, there is a hidden room, but it wasn't added in 1.20, so I'm gonna say this is false. Can you you shoot projectiles through a nether portal? Okay, it doesn't seem to have gone through, but let's check. There's no way to really tell. We need a wall. And yeah, there's actually arrows on the other side. This one is true. Do piglins wear mob heads? There's no way this one is actually true. This looks so funny. Wait, what if you use a piglin head on a piglin? Okay, this one is really cursed. He has double ears. Powdered snow stops you from burning in the nether. Don't try this at home, guys. And yeah, it works, but you don't get to keep the snow. It's a one-time use. Wait, if it stops burning in the nether, you can probably clutch with it as well. Yeah, this one is true, and it also doesn't melt. Can you light a nether portal with a bed? This one is true, but it's just the explosion doing it, not the bed. Does a cursive binding book get stuck in a bookshelf? No, it doesn't. I can still take it out. Do jukeboxes emit particles when you play music? Yeah, this one is true. I've never seen this before. Can you die from dehydration in Minecraft? Obviously, there is no thirst meter in Minecraft, but apparently with this command, it will say you died of dehydration. Yeah, it's true. I guess I gotta start drinking some liquids. Can you make a giant cherry tree? tree. Okay, it doesn't grow into one giant tree. And yeah, that doesn't really look that much bigger than normal either. Are emeralds more common in cherry biomes? I don't really know how to test this one, but I'm seeing some emeralds, so at least they do spawn in a cherry biome. I have no idea if they're more common here, though. Does a camel fit in a boat? No, it does not. This guy is way too big. What about a sniffer? A sniffer also doesn't fit in a boat. This is sad. He'll never be able to become a pirate. Apparently, there's a new way to get command blocks. So if you click on options and go to controls, you can enable operator items tab. And yeah, yeah, now when you're in creative, there's this new tab with all sorts of blocks you had to use slash give for before. Does a sniffer egg survive being hit by an anvil? So if you do this to turtle eggs, this is what happens. So I wonder if the same thing happens with sniffer eggs. Yeah, the sniffer egg somehow survives, that's insane, but the anvil doesn't drop this time. What about TNT? Okay, it's not that strong. RIP snifflets. Does waterlogging a skulk shrieker stop it from making noise? Yeah, it's not making noise. I wonder if this also stops the warden from spawning. No, it does not. Does killing an elder guardian drop an armor trim? Okay, nothing so far. And yeah, tied armor trim. These guys can also drop fish, which is kind of weird. I don't think they are fish. Is there a hidden gold block in the new trail ruin structure? Okay, so I definitely meant to do what just happened, and I don't really see any gold blocks here. I'm gonna say it's false. Do diamonds spawn under the middle of trail ruins? Okay, so this looks like the center. Let's dig down. There's no diamonds, it's false. Everyone knows you can name a sheep Jeb and it turns rainbow, but does this work for a sniffer? No, it doesn't. What about naming a camel? No, this one also doesn't work. I guess we're stuck with regular mobs. Can piglins open doors? Wait, they actually can. That's so cool. Can you break bamboo blocks faster with a sword? Okay, so this is with a fist and this is with a sword. I don't think it's any different. Apparently, XP bottles can make a block of redstone or glow. Yeah, it's actually glowing and that's a lot of particles. You can also just do this by right-clicking it 
it though, the XP bottles don't really matter. Apparently there is blue magma in Minecraft 1.20. Oh my god, there actually is. No way. It's definitely not fake. Do torch flowers emit light just like torches? Oh wait, I probably need to turn off Fulbright. No, it's still really dark in here. The torch doesn't mean anything. Can you use a brush on a dragon egg? So when you right click a dragon egg, normally it teleports away. But what if you use a brush? No, it still teleports away. I guess you can't clean your dragon eggs. Can you put armor trims on horse armor? No, unfortunately you can't give your horse some drip. If you put a flower into a crafting space, it turns into a single color of dye, but apparently you can craft a pitcher plant into two dyes. Yeah, this is true. I guess the flower is just so big it gives you two dyes instead. Is rain invisible through black glass? So this is what rain looks like through regular glass. You can still see it. And this is what it looks like with black glass. This one is true. I wonder if it also works on snow. Yeah, it does. Can you dye the highlighted part on the new decorated pot? No, it's still yellow. This one isn't true. Is there a new bamboo village in the jungle biome? Okay, so when I use slash locate, I'm not really seeing anything that would be a bamboo village. And I'm also not seeing anything in this jungle. This one is probably false. Can you smelt netherite armor and tools into netherite scraps? So everyone knows you can do this with gold and iron armor and tools, but it doesn't seem to be working with netherite armor or tools, so it's false. I don't see why you would ever need to do this anyways, so that's probably why. Can you dry a wet sponge using a campfire? Okay, so you can't place the sponge on the campfire, so this is already not looking good. Yeah, the steak is cooked and the sponge is still wet. I don't think it's true. Is there a new cherry dimension in 1.20? Yeah, I think it's kind of obvious that this one isn't true. Wait, never mind guys, 100% real cherry dimension. Apparently sniffers can't drown because their eggs come from the water. Okay, he's sniffing the water. Maybe this one is true. Never mind, this is definitely not true. I'm also not gonna help him out of the water. I'm a hater. You can plant mangrove trees underwater. So if you place a regular sapling here, it just breaks. But yeah, the mangrove propagule can be placed underwater. Are phantoms afraid of cats? So let's place a bunch of phantoms down, and now we'll get some cats. And yeah, the phantoms don't seem to be attacking me. Also, this noise is terrifying. What is that? Can you clutch on a sniffer? So these guys look kind of soft, so hopefully this works. Okay, it definitely doesn't work. This is false. Can you put horse armor on a camel? No, you can't. And even if you could, you wouldn't be able to use the saddle, so it would suck anyway. Are villagers able to sleep in the nether? Yeah, this one is true. These guys somehow don't make the bed explode. Whoops, I didn't think that would happen. Apparently, the warden isn't actually blind. So in spectator mode, you can see what any mob sees by left-clicking on it. And that includes the warden, who is definitely able to see from what I'm seeing. Apparently, you can't name a mob name tag. Yeah, so you can't even name a name tag name tag. But you can do it like this, so I guess it's false? Oh wait, I actually just found a way to do it, technically. Does a potion of luck change the loot inside a chest? So this is the loot in the chest right now, and now I have the luck effect. And it's the same loot in the chest. This is false. You can make a minecart that infinitely moves. So apparently if you stack a bunch of minecarts in each other, they will never stop moving. Yeah, this one is true, and it's also really weird. Why does this work? Apparently a camel can survive a 50 block fall. Sorry man, I gotta do this. It's actually true, it somehow lived, but now can I survive the fall while riding a camel? Okay, this one isn't true. The camel did not absorb my fall. Can a camel prevent you from being hit by mobs? This one is true. They're not hitting me. But I'm curious if this also works on the warden. Okay, it actually doesn't look like he can hit me. Wow, the warden's getting a little close. Naming your seed cherry blossom spawns you in a cherry blossom biome. It's true, but it's the smallest cherry blossom biome I've ever seen. Are all sheep pink in a cherry blossom biome? This one isn't true, but let's just pretend it is. It looks a lot better this way. Can you undye leather armor using a Cauldron. Wow, this one is actually true. And you can also dye wool that has already died. This one is true as well, and you can do it with every colorable item, just to be clear. Apparently, you can swap your elytra out without opening your inventory. This one is true, but you better carry a water bucket with you just in case. Does a bamboo raft move faster than a regular boat? So this is me riding both of the boats. It doesn't look like the bamboo one is any faster. This is false. Can you clutch on a camel? You can clutch on a horse, so this should be possible. As long as I don't mess this up of course. And yes, you can do it. This makes up for him killing me earlier. You can die a camel's saddle. Nope, this one isn't true, but it would be cool if it was. Apparently, mobs can't jump over hanging signs. So I've placed a fence of hanging signs around me, and now let's see if all these zombies can get to me. Okay, they can. This one is definitely not true. If you place a hanging sign like this, apparently mobs can't follow you through it. And it's true. Who knew zombies were this stupid? The nether portal animation is fixed in 1.20. So this is what the animation used to look like, and now it's 
supposed to stop the animation from playing again when you go through? Yes, this one is true. Can a piglin head prevent you from being attacked by piglins? No, it can't. We've already seen this. They don't accept me. What about if you wear armor with a gold trim on it? Nope, it appears I still have a five-star wanted level. What about if you wear gold armor with a trim on it? Okay, this one was obviously gonna work. They gotta respect a man with some drip. A piglin head flops its ears when it's powered by redstone. This one is true, and also kind of weird. Does this mean mobs are powered by redstone? Apparently, a dragon head can now open its mouth. This one is also true. I honestly have no idea if this one is new or not, though. I don't usually wear a dragon's head. There is a new vex in Minecraft 1.20. So this is what an old vex used to look like. Kind of scary if you ask me. And this is the new vex. This one is true. It kind of looks like an evil allay. Speaking of evil allays, does the new vex attack allays? Okay, it doesn't really look like they attack each other. They're just chilling. Does a sniffer egg hatch faster on moss? So here's my egg on moss, and here's the regular egg. Now we just wait. And yeah, this one is true. The egg on moss hatched way faster. You can make a sniffer carpet. This is actually just from my build hacks video. It's not really a myth. No sniffers were harmed in the making of... No, actually they were. I'm not gonna lie. Can you ride a sniffer? So my right click says you can't, but this command says I can. But since you can't do it without cheats, I'm going to say it's false. You can heal camels with cactuses. I can't imagine this one is true because of what I'm seeing right now. Okay, never mind. He somehow eats that. That's true. You are able to sprint on camels. This one is true, but you might not notice it if you use toggle sprint since it just sprints by default. Can sniffers dig for seeds in the nether? He's sniffing the air. I wonder what he's got a hold of. Okay, just ignore that. I don't know how that got here. Yeah, this one is false. He isn't digging for anything. Apparently, there is a new built-in resource pack. Yes, there is high contrast mode, but all it really does is edit the UI and nothing else changes. Jukeboxes can emit a redstone signal. Let's just pick out some quality music here. Yep, this one is true, and I may have also summoned Hero. Brian. If you punch a decorated pot, it won't break. Yes, this one is true. It just drops the pot instead of the shards. And speaking of shards, can you copy them like an armor template? No, this one unfortunately isn't true. You're gonna have to find these manually. Are you able to craft a plain pot using just bricks? Okay, it's a good thing I'm bricked up for this myth. Yes, this one is true. I now have a lot of plain pots. Apparently, you can get the ward armor trim for killing the warden. Okay, this is taking way too long. I'm just using the command. No, he still drops the skulk thing, whatever it is. The new damage looks like bedrock. Yeah, this is true, unfortunately. I don't really like how this looks. Also, you can apparently change the amount of shake when you get hit. Okay, this one is also true, and this looks even weirder, honestly. It kind of looks like I'm in spectator. Can you get apples from a cherry wood tree? Okay, so far, this one isn't looking good. Yeah, I broke all the leaves on the tree and not a single apple. This one is false. Apparently, you can now edit signs. Okay, yeah, I already knew this one was true, and along with editing signs, you are also able to write on the back of them. And you can right-click them with a honeycomb, and it makes it so you can't edit them anymore. That one I actually didn't know. That's pretty interesting. Do chiseled bookshelves increase enchantment levels? Okay, so we have filled them all with books, now let's see if it increases the levels. Nope, this one isn't true. Can you fill chiseled bookshelves using hoppers? Yes, you can do this, and apparently you can also put plants in pots using hoppers. Okay, I don't think it's true. There is a new Cherry Blossom Villager variant. No, there isn't, which means there probably isn't a Cherry Blossom Village either. But it would definitely be cool if they added one, because this biome is a little boring. Can you use Silk Touch to mine suspicious blocks? Okay, so we tried it on gravel and it didn't work, and it also doesn't work on sand. This is false. Apparently, there is a new Potion of Luck in Minecraft. There actually is a Potion of Luck. When applied, plus one luck. I don't really know what that means, but hopefully it doesn't turn me into a leprechaun. Can you transport pets on a camel? So I don't really know how you would do this, I'm assuming my dog would just get on the camel, and it isn't. So this one is false. Are you able to swim on a camel? Okay, it's kind of working, but he's sinking slowly, and yeah, it kicked me off. I want to say this one is false, but it's also kind of true, because he can swim for a second, so I don't know. If you put a mob head above a note block, it will play a sound from that mob. Yeah, this one is true, and it works for every mob, including the skeleton. That was definitely real. Another thing you can apparently do is optimize your world. Yeah, this one is true, but I don't really know what it does. I think it's supposed to be for older worlds, because it didn't really seem to do anything. Can a sniffer survive a hit from the warden? Okay, so we have our sniffer and our warden. We just gotta wait for this guy to find him. He's kinda blind. Okay, the sniffer died in one hit. This one isn't true. But what about a camel? Can a camel survive a warden? We just gotta wait for this again. 
Oh, and it actually worked. A camel can survive one hit from the warden. Camels really are just built different. Does spawning a cow in a cherry blossom biome make it a mulip? No, it does not. Is there a secret room in the desert temple? Yes, there actually is in the back corner, and this is what it looks like. Are there new potions in Minecraft? So the potions aren't new, but all the colors are changed, and I'm honestly not a fan of this. Like, why is night vision green? Who did this? You no longer have to spam place paintings. Yeah, all the paintings are now selectable by their variants, so now it's a lot easier to get which one you want. This isn't really a thing in survival, though, so you're still stuck spam placing them if that's the case. Is the bundle in Minecraft 1.20? There is still no bundle in the creative inventory, but you can still give it to yourself with a command. I wonder when they will finally add this thing. Apparently, hanging signs don't break when you break their supporting block. Yeah, this one is true. How is this even possible? This is definitely an illegal building technique. Apparently, armor stands now have arms. Okay, so the logic behind this one is that it has arms in a smithing table. But no, the armor stand doesn't have arms. Does landing on a sniffer egg break it? No, either the sniffer egg is really strong or I'm not heavy enough. It's probably the first one. Can you ride a baby camel? No, you can't, unfortunately. But can you put chests on a camel? You also can't do this, but you'd think a mob this strong would be able to do that. Apparently, frogs follow you if you hold slime balls. Okay, so I don't think this one is 1.20 related, and I also can't even tell if it's true. Yeah, it's probably true. He seems to be following me. There is a new way to change your GUI scale. Apparently, if you hold control and scroll at the same time, it changes your GUI scale. Okay, so nothing is happening right now, but what if we try it in the options menu? Now it's working. Yeah, this one is true, but you're already in the options menu, so it's not really that cool. Apparently, harming potions ignore armor. So that did five and a half hearts. Now let's put armor on. Yeah, it did the same amount of damage. I guess armor is just useless. Apparently, you can trap and kill the warden with powdered snow. Alright, he's trapped. And it's working. He's dying. Okay, this is kind of sad. I'm gonna help him out. Apparently, you can repair an iron golem. Oh, I can't hurt this one. Sorry, bro. Wait, it actually repairs him. I almost certainly thought this one was fake. It sounds so stupid. Apparently, you can sleep underwater. Let's just make it night. Wait, how does this work? Bro, I'm amphibious or something. What? You can make a two-block jump with a bubble column. I'm going higher, but it's not two blocks. Oh, you have to run at it for it to work. And it's actually pretty consistent when you have the timing. Hitting a mob through fire sets the mob on fire. Nope. Pretty sure I would have known about this if it was true. You can shoot fire arrows through the bottom of a lava cauldron. Wait, it works. You just have to angle it right. This is sick. As you know, you can block a beacon by placing a block above it. But apparently the beacon's beam can go through bedrock. Here it is with stone. As you can see, it blocks it. Now we'll try bedrock. What? I guess stone is stronger than bedrock now. That's so weird. Reinforced deep slate drops with silk touch. This is gonna take a while. I better not be getting trolled. We're almost there. And it did nothing. Nice. Apparently you can put thorns on an armor stand. So I have a full set of thorns three armor. Let's put it on the stand. No, I'm not taking any damage. I kind of wish this one was true though. It would be cool. Prismarine blocks change colors. All right, time to stare at a block. It actually looks like it's changing. I think this is true. Yeah, there's actually a huge difference between the two. Striders can protect you from baby zombies. Let's get on this guy, and we'll go survival. Yeah, they can't hit me. I'm invincible. No baby zombie can ever kill me again. Apparently, you can light two portals inside of each other. Alright, we have a weird portal. Aw, oh, that would have been so cool. Mojang, please add this in 1.20. We need double portals. Mobs can't kill you in sugarcane. Let's put some zombies and a skeleton. Now I will set my game mode. I don't think it worked. This would be cool if it was true though. You get more experience from fortune. So I have a default pickaxe and a fortune 3 pickaxe. No fortune gave me almost 10 levels. And I got less levels with fortune. This one isn't true. Spiders can climb the world border. Not too sure about this one. Oh wait, he's doing the thing. Spider climbing the world border. Where will he go? Actually, when will he stop? This is getting dangerous. Apparently, spiders also infinitely climb the world border. Apparently, you can ignite TNT with a fishing rod. Now we just fish through the lava. Yeah, it works. I guess there is a reason to fish in lava now. Apparently, you can also pull TNT towards you with a fishing rod. Yeah, it works. I have no idea why this would be useful, but it's cool. You can put a boat in a minecart. Wait, what? Why does that work? I'm pressing W and going backwards. This is so weird. Wait, what if I put a boat in a minecart in a minecart? Oh, it doesn't work. Apparently, you can dodge Sonic Boom. Nope. Still no. 
Oh, you can. It's just hard because you have to do it really fast. Undead mobs don't burn underneath cobwebs. So I trapped a zombie and a skeleton in a hole. Let's set it today. Wait, they're actually not burning. And as you can see, these guys are burning. This one is somehow true. This doesn't even make sense. Apparently, ghasts can't see you behind cobwebs. I'm trapping myself in cobwebs. I don't think it worked, guys. Oh, not the underwater bed. Apparently, rain kills snow golems. Flash weather rain. Wow, I've never seen something die so fast. Yeah, this one's true. You can kill the ender dragon with snowballs. I can't tell if I'm missing or if it doesn't work. Yeah, I don't think it's working. It's weird though because they aren't even hitting the dragon. Coal blocks last longer than 9 coal in a furnace. Time for some waiting. 9 coal finished first. I guess it's actually worth it to craft coal blocks. Holding control while using pig block gives you a chest with the same items. Now we have a ton of useful loot in this chest. And we just hold control. Yeah, it actually works. Awkward splash potions stop fire damage. Don't try this at home, guys. Nope, I'm still on fire. You can't spawn a wither in a snow biome. This one is true. I have no idea why, but it does work. Apparently, you can MLG into a cauldron. Okay, I gotta line myself up perfectly. Nope, that's unfortunate. Apparently, if you hold crouch, you can MLG on leaves in 1.19. Alright, I'm holding crouch. Nope, it still waterlogs it. Can you burn waterlogged leaves? It won't let me set them on fire. Yeah, it doesn't look like they can burn. Apparently, polar bears attack foxes. I think it's true, but he's gonna have to catch him. I don't think the polar bear is fast enough. Alright, I'm gonna cut the video before the fox gets hurt. Oh. Apparently, you can give a boat a name tag. Let's name it something cool and original. Oh yeah, I have to crouch. It's not working. Maybe we have to name the boat. Guys, please just do it. No, it still won't work. It's just a boat. Apparently, deep slay ores give more XP. Okay, we got eight and a half levels from regular. And we got nine levels from deep slate. Since the amount of XP you get is random, I don't think this is a big enough difference for it to be true. You can fish in a cauldron. Whoops. Yeah, there's no way I'm fishing anything out of here. You can't fish in a cauldron, but can you put fish in a cauldron? Nope, it just goes on top. Although sometimes the fish will go in the cauldron for a second. Killing a wither skeleton with a charged creeper always drops a skull. Oh, we gotta be quick here. There's one. There's two. There's three. Either my luck is insane or this one is true. You can smelt nether gold into a gold ingot. Wait, it's smelting. Yeah, it works. I guess this should have been obvious, but you do only get a few nuggets from breaking it, so I wasn't sure. Apparently, you can clutch with a skulk vein. Ow. No, you can't. Hostile mobs do not spawn in mushroom biomes. It's nighttime and I don't see anything spawning. Alright, there would definitely be mobs by now. This one is true. Apparently, you can't milk a mushroom cow. Nope, you still can. And you can also milk them for soup. You can make a car in Minecraft. So if I put a pig in a minecart, it's supposed to be like a car. Well, I can only move backwards and I move very slowly, but I guess it's a car? Just like you can break an end portal frame, you can break bedrock with a giant mushroom. Nope, the bedrock is still there. I wonder why it works with end portal frames and not bedrock. Apparently bees can pollinate nether wart. No, it doesn't look like it. If you give a wither skeleton a bow, it will shoot fire arrows. So if I type this crazy command, I get a wither skeleton with a bow. And yeah, it's shooting fire arrows, that's terrifying. You can use gold nuggets as fuel in a furnace. No, you can't. I think you can in bedrock though. Apparently if you give a fox frostwalker boots, it will turn water to ice. We just need him to touch water. Nope, it doesn't work. I'm gonna need these back. Apparently you can't lose hunger on a boat. Okay, I'm giving myself hunger 200. It doesn't appear to be working. But if I don't have the hunger effect, it seems to be true. Apparently there's an infinite flower glitch. Yo, we're printing money. Wolves hunt down skeletons. So if I put this skeleton in a box... Oh, get out of here. So if I put a skeleton out of sight, apparently a wolf will hunt for it. I don't think it's working. Maybe it has to be my dog? Nah, he's just vibing. If you put a Jeb underscore name tag on a dog, apparently its collar becomes rainbow. So this should happen just with the collar instead. No, it didn't work. It just names your dog Jeb. Apparently, Endermen are not able to teleport out of a two-block hole. Alright, he's in a two-block hole. Nope, that happened instantly. The Warden's Sonic Boom ability apparently ignores armor. Here's me using no armor. Okay, it did two and a half hearts. Here's me with full netherite now. Wait, it did three hearts. It did more damage. What? 
Okay, apparently you also can't block Sonic Boom with a shield. What? No way, as if the Warden wasn't already powerful enough. Does mud dry out in the nether? No, it does not. Well, at least not instantly. Can mud be used to put out fire damage? Time to set myself on fire. Don't try this at home. Nope, I'm still on fire. Apparently 1.19 added jungle villages. Okay, I'm using slash locate, and these are the only village types available. There are no jungle villages. There aren't jungle villages, but apparently there are jungle villagers. Wait, no way, that's so sick. Apparently there are also swamp villagers. What? No way, it's like a non-mean looking witch. Why are these in the game with no villages? You can use reinforced deep slate to trap the wither. Now we spawn the wither. Will it get out? No, it seems to be stuck. Even in survival, it won't come get me. But I guess this would only be useful if you could mine reinforced deep slate, but it's still cool. If you place your own shrieker, it can't spawn a warden. So I've placed my own shrieker. And yeah, it's been three times and nothing has happened. This one is true. Apparently there's a new portal in the deep dark. Let's light this. Wait, what? Okay, obviously I'm joking. This is a texture pack. Apparently you can heal vexes into LAs by giving them milk. All right, I'm giving him milk and nothing is happening. This one is fake. Can you use goat horns to call goats over to you? Eh, he's looking at me. No, it does not work. He's not coming over here. Do you need silk touch to mine a skulk sensor? All right, nothing dropped with no silk touch. And it drops with silk touch. This one is true. Okay, I found out I'm supposed to use a hoe and not a pickaxe. I don't want to hear it. You can now place water inside of leaves. So just like a sign or a slab, I should be able to do this on leaves. Yes, it works, and it doesn't even flow out either. That's so cool. Swift Sneak makes dive mining faster. So that was me mining without Swift Sneak. And yeah, I mean, I move faster, but it doesn't make me mine any faster. So I would say this one isn't true. If you spawn a frog in a jungle, it becomes a poisonous frog. All right, here's the smallest jungle ever. Spawning a frog. Nope, it does not seem to be poisonous. Apparently, LAs can mine diamonds for you. So if I give an LA diamond ore, it's supposed to mine diamonds for me. Nope, this obviously wasn't going to work, but it can collect diamonds for you. If you listen to the new music disc in the deep dark, it spawns Harrowbrine. Okay, we have our jukebox and the music disc. Let's see. I don't really see anything around here. Oh my god! There's nothing. Harrowbrine was removed a long time ago, guys. Right? The new music disc can be used to light the portal in the deep dark. Nope, nothing is happening. And this disc is scary, I'm turning it off. You can't spawn a warden on the surface. Well, since you can't spawn a warden using your own shrieker, it's impossible for one to spawn on the surface. Frogs will eat magma cubes and drop a frog light. Oh, this one's true. Not these guys though, they're too big. Apparently you can find skeleton skulls in an ancient city. Dang, I really thought one would be here. Oh, there's one over here, it's true. Blowing up ores now gives you experience. I think I used too much TNT. Let's try just one. And it works, the XP dropped. Furnace minecarts now work like regular furnace blocks. All right, I'm right clicking it and nothing is happening. Let's try it with food in my hand. Still nothing, this one doesn't work. Apparently tadpoles are scared of axolotls. Wow, the axolotl's going crazy. It doesn't look like the tadpole is afraid though. The warden is lava proof apparently. It's true. The warden is even more powerful than I thought. You can use water to silence skulk sensors. Yeah, it's making no noise, but there's still the pulse thingy. And as you can see, the redstone works, but it's making no sound. Apparently, the Moo Bloom was added in 1.19. Oh, guys, look, it's the Moo Bloom. No way, no way. Apparently, mobs now spawn inside of nether portals. So I've built a portal on the nether roof, so they should have the best chance of spawning here. Okay, this one might be true, but it's going to take forever if it is. Can Alays use a Totem of Undying? We'll just put some lava. Nope, we'll put some lava. Wow, this guy's fast. Okay, we finally got him. And it worked, he used the totem to survive, that's crazy. You can place structures with the command in 1.19. Alright, slash structure doesn't work. Okay, it's slash place structure, and yeah, you can place any structure just like this. Just like this. Now you can beat the game in super flat. There are new secret paintings in 1.19. So you just do this command, and this should be a new painting. Yeah, it works. There are also three other new paintings you can get with this command. Apparently you sink in mud just like powdered snow. I don't appear to be sinking. It does lower you by like 0.1 of a block though. Using Riptide on a trident while riding a boat makes you go faster. All right, let's get in a boat. Nope, I can't even use a trident in a boat. It doesn't even let me right click. The fletching table can now be used to make tipped arrows. All right, I'm right clicking on it and nothing is happening. Let's try it in survival. Still nothing. 
Even with an arrow, it still doesn't work. This one isn't true. Apparently, tropical fish spawn in mangrove swamps. I'm kind of lost in here. This biome is so cool. Oh wait, those are tropical fish, right? Yep, so it's true. Minecraft now apparently has directional audio. So you go to music and sounds, and yeah, there's directional audio. And as you can see, it works. Well, as you can hear, it works. Also, I'm not sure if you can hear it properly on the video, but I am confirming it works. Can you distract the warden with XP bottles? He does seem to be distracted by them, but it doesn't seem to work in survival. You can name locations with a banner. So you just name the banner, and then you right click with a map. That didn't work. Oh, so it has to be an existing map. Yeah, that's really cool, actually. Apparently, you can put a chest in a boat now. So if I right click this boat, nothing happens, but you can craft it. Now I have a chest on my boat, that's sick. You can find diamond armor in the ancient city. Nope. Nothing. There's iron armor. Still nothing. There it is, diamond leggings. Curse of binding, but it's still diamond. Oh, hello warden. Apparently you can spawn fireflies with a command. I'm using slash summon and there are no fireflies. There's a game rule to disable the warden. There actually is a command for it. And as you can see, no warden spawns. This is really cool. Well, if you're a baby. I mean, I would probably use it though. Apparently, baby pandas can sneeze out a slime ball. We've got 1 million pandas here. I'm hearing them sneeze, but no slime balls. Okay, so apparently I have to spawn lazy pandas. Yeah, I've been waiting for a while and there are still no slime balls, so I don't know. You can use a book to spawn infinite dimensions. So all I have to do is throw the book in here. Nope, we're still in the nether. Okay, so this was actually from an April Fool's snapshot. I'm stupid. There's a secret redstone room under the ancient city. There is one. Okay, I already knew this, but maybe some people didn't, so here you go. Perfect place to get random redstone stuff. Apparently, vines and glow lichen can be placed on soul sand, and it looks like you can. I have no idea why you couldn't do this before 1.19. Apparently, walking on wool makes the skulk sensor not hear you. Yes, yeah, so this is one of the main features of the skulk sensor, and as you can see, it is true. Apparently, there are alligators in 1.19. Of course, there are alligators in 1.19. That's one of the main features. Apparently, mangrove trees don't have saplings. Mangrove trees do not have saplings. You have to use these weird propagale things to grow them instead. Apparently the bundle has been added to 1.19, so there is no bundle in the creative menu, but I can give it to myself, but since there is still no way to obtain it, I would say this is false. Apparently minecarts with an attached block now stay together when you break them. Oh, it's actually true. I'm pretty sure this never used to exist, that's cool. Apparently you can use cheats in survival without enabling them. So as you saw, I made a world with cheats off. Yeah, it does nothing. I don't know why this would work. Apparently there's an advancement for killing a mob near a skulk catalyst. Let's just kill this guy quickly. Yeah, it spreads as the advancement. Apparently there's also an advancement for having every frog light in your inventory. Yep, there's also an advancement for that. Apparently the end portal frame texture is now different. Alright, you guys tell me if you can see the difference.